Okay, folks, had many of you uh, since posting this to Craigslist a couple of days ago uh, that have been very interested in this uh, ha handicap accessible motorhome but have wanted to see some video footage of it. So I'm going to go through it real quick for you and post it to YouTube so that anybody that wants to can take a look at it. You see, there's two doors obviously, the regular entrance door with power steps, and then uh, you've got your wheelchair accessible door here to the right. We'll just hit that right off the bat since this is kind of what this what this motorhome is all about. Pin this door in place real quick. And right in here are your is your controls and your control box. Grab that off the wall there. Try and stand back here to where everybody can see how this operates. This is a uh, was a factory installed lift. As a matter of fact, everything on this coach was factory done, uh, custom built, just like you see it. Now this motorhome, model 34W, was built as a standard model. This was one that they took and did specially custom made for somebody, though. All right. So once that's done, uh, you've now got your side rails that just pick up on both sides. Like so, and once that's done, you see the little uh, ramp extension there on the end. We'll pick that up, and now we're ready to uh, go ahead and go on in. And there we are. Now we can roll right on in. Um, I think I read on here somewhere this has either it's 750 or 800 pound capacity, so it is big enough to pick up uh, two people at once. Uh, you could stand on here with the remote in your hand uh, with the person that you have in the wheelchair and pick the two of you up at the same time. Um, let's go ahead and, and uh, go on inside and we'll take a look inside at the rest of the coach. You see the electric steps. Um, aside from uh, the handicap accessible lift, the passenger seat is also handicap accessible. You'll see the controls down here on it, uh, specifically designed for somebody with these needs. It goes really far forward and really far back. It picks up and swivels all electronically. The passenger, or the uh, driver's seat, is just a standard driver's seat. See down here. Uh, there's your hydraulic leveling system. See right there, it's got 29,521 miles on it. Backup camera, all the good stuff. TV up front, um, right in here in this cabinet. Um, the owner who traded this in to us has kept all of the records ever since he's owned it right here in that uh, file case all its service and maintenance records um, you'll see you got nice wide access all the way through the back uh, Corian countertops As a matter of fact you can probably see right there the little Corian symbol um, pull out spray faucet uh, Corian sink covers table and chairs for, for easy access and then back here in the back as we walk through um, first of all on this side nice nice easy access to everything in the bathroom and then over on this side nice wide roll in uh, shower now the, the narrowest point is this access right between here and into the bedroom and it is two feet six and a half inches wide as you come through here, uh, wider than anything else uh, that we have on our lot, but a person would be able to roll right on back, all the way through, back between these two twin beds on either side, uh, to comfortably get in here to go to bed at night. You got uh, his and her storage, or his and his, whatever the case may be. You've got two sets of hanging storage on both sides, and storage up along the top. This coach has two air conditioners on it, big furnace, 
you know, all the good stuff. Awning, microwave convection oven, big 8 cubic foot nor cold refrigerator. Um, everything you'd expect on a nice motor home. It is on a Ford chassis. Looks like the, the big V10. Um, you see uh, it does have the, the big generator. We can take a walk outside real quick and show you. Because if this if this coach does have a flaw, it's it's out here on the outside. And that is down here along the uh, skirting part, if you will, down here where these baggage doors are. You can probably see how the paint down here has started to fade. Um, the rest of the coach is, looks like to be in real nice shape. But down there along the bottom it has started to uh, has started to fade. I'll just kind of walk you around it real quick. Let you see kind of a full view. Hopefully the sun doesn't get in our way too bad. There's your backup camera on the back. You see that it's got the uh, receiver hitch and is all ready to tow back here. And then this is along this driver's side portion of the coach here. Get a quick shot of the front of this. And then we'll just show you real quick how this unit stows. It's pretty simple. You just put your rails down. And then once again we'll grab our, our control. Stand off here to the side so you can see. And on here, we're just going to hit the stow button. You can see it's just going to put itself away. That's all there is to it. She's up out of the way. So, any questions, please feel free to give me a call. 307-247-2550.